a geriatric 1927, an internet phenomenon whose online chats about the good old days have landed him a loyal army of fans. He could be the key to our marketing. a record to get in the pop charts. Oh my gosh! <laughs> so, could we kind of count on you to help us, help us out and give it a push? I'd help any way I could, yes. That would be great. With our group of aged rockers on board, we had just one day of rehearsals before the single would be recorded. I'd come to pick up Joan, who was still nervous about leaving the... The old people I'd met were arriving at the rehearsal studios from across the country. For some, it was the first time they'd been in London. For everyone, it was about old people having a go at doing something different and giving the profits to charity. Oh, fine, thank you. Oh, it's oh, so exciting. Um, do you know, I hadn't been in a fast train before. <laughs> well, one, one without staying in the coaches but only had a couple of hours to turn our 40 geriatrics into chart assaulting rockers. We are going to stone the charts, 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 we are going to
various reasons. We've met you all over the last few weeks and months. Some of you are in old people care homes and, and you're bored there. Others have seen some of the more atrocious stuff there. Some of you are uh, in, in tower blocks and, and don't really get out and go for, for months and longer without actually seeing anybody. Uh, others of you are having the daily heart of your social life ripped out. And some of you are just here to lend solidarity. But above all, it's about the message that you're not invisible. Today, you're not invisible. This is about old people not being brushed under the carpet. And, and what better way than breaking into the pop charts? Where the journey's going, I have no idea either. <laughs> We're gonna, as long as we all enjoy ourselves today, the most important thing is we really enjoy ourselves, have a really good time, and give it a lot of attitude. I was gonna put my sunglasses in. You should be hearing some music in a minute. <laughs> I was completely oblivious to the in a world of my own. Enjoy it. I was enjoying it. The only people who didn't seem to be enjoying themselves were Mike and his team, who were struggling to find anyone actually singing in tune. Yeah. Sort this out. So they're optically tight amongst themselves, so it makes it a little bit complex to actually work out what they're singing. So um, we're relying pretty much on the soloists now to give us a lead line that we can use. Mm. So it's all down to Alf, really? It's all down to Alf. People try to put us down Just because we get around Things they do look awful cold I hope I die before they get old. That's sounding very good to us. What? You sound like you're enjoying that. I'm just gonna go and kiss Alf. Thank you so much. <laughs> if, if you'd like a kiss, purely platonically or anything. I know it's a fairly old song. For one magical afternoon, all 40 of them came alive before returning to their old invisible lives in care homes and tower blocks. At least at Abbey Road, they'd had a nice day out, which was more than many had had in a long time. But then it all turned into something quite remarkable. A whirlwind began to gather around the Zimmers. It started with a small piece about Winnie in the Ilkeston Advertiser. Then the national newspapers began picking up on the Zimmers. It was when the video was put onto the internet by a band member, Geriatric 1927, that things really took off. Some live performances merely fueled Zimmer mania. The Zimmers video has been watched a staggering two million times on YouTube. It's become one of the most watched online videos in the whole world. The Zimmers have touched a global nerve. Media from Germany, America, Canada, Iceland, Israel, France, Brazil, Japan, Australia, television and newspaper interviews to more than 50 countries. There have been radio appearances and talk shows, all before the CD has even hit the shops. Tonight, England's newest musical sensation, the Zimmers. They didn't even have rock music back when the Zimmers were, you know, teenagers. 